10 years looking at ESG. It started off as a very pure um, topic and it, a product that could really help an investor focus what it wanted to do with its money and how it wanted to, to utilize that. And it's been completely hijacked and it's what financial markets do. Financial markets are driven by the need to make money and the investors that put that money in are driven by the need to make money out of their investment as well. And ESG is a classic example of you set some rules, you set some benchmarks and some post points that qualify an investment product that you structure for your client to be ESG compatible. So the client comes along and says, I want to be more ethically invested in X, Y, and Z. The biggest tool that you could give the financial market is rules. The financial market loves rules because rules allow the financial market to skirt rules and to get around them. And ESG is the perfect example. You know, we took a pure product that was developed out of conversations from your sphere, your sphere of the world, and people were beginning to realize and understand that something needed to be done and they wanted to be part of it. ESG isn't that, it's a tick box exercise that's grown exponentially in terms of the assets under management because they'll sell anything that will produce fees and it's been completely corrupted. And I think the problem that you have with the financial market is don't expect it to help. It'll only help when it's incentivized to do it. And it comes back to the earlier conversation we had where policy needs to be much better at educating the voter about what it wants and how it should expect that to come about. Financial markets will not do it on their own. So do you think the incentives should come like from downstream. So maybe it will start from consumers, so value the products of like greener firms and they will that will give an incentive to well, firms to change their behavior and then the financial sector will find it more profitable to absolutely provide so the good thing about the financial sector there are some good things believe it or not but the good thing about the financial <laughs> sector is that once you point it in the direction and once you get its enthusiasm on a topic it can do amazing things and it will do them incredibly quickly so in terms of implementing some of these changes and helping fund the innovation fund things that can make a difference a real difference and move the needle the financial market can do that but it needs to have the incentive to do it and i sadly think that it's not going to do it on its own and it needs to come from politics we had a conversation earlier so about... So it's tech, not carrot. 